if you're in business, you keep hearing the term quiet quitting. And the reality is, is that this is impacting companies. HR people are really concerned as people are working remotely. Oftentimes they're not really doing their job and they're just taking their paycheck and they're sort of just waiting out the game till something else comes along. However, this can be very disruptive to your company. I have been a keynote speaker and workshop trainer who talks about business relationships, trust, and accountability. And I've been doing this for 15 years. Now, lots of times when people hear that is my topic, they think this is a topic for people who are outside sales, for lawyers who are trying to grow their business, for other people who want to build a reputation in their community, or for people who are looking for jobs. But the reality is this topic is more important for your company than ever before. The idea of relationships, trust, and accountability matter more now than ever in the business world, and it matters around this whole idea of quiet quitting. If you're looking to have your people be more engaged, show up and do their work, and be excited to be part of your team, you need to get them connected. Human engagement is something we all long for, and yet we spent a couple of years working remotely. And all the studies show that people feel more disconnected and alone than they ever have before. And if your employees feel disconnected and alone, you run the risk that they could quietly quit or loudly quit and move on to somebody else. So I would love to talk to your organization about how this idea of community, collaboration, and conversations can be the foundation that keep people engaged in your company. Gallup has done surveys over the years that show that when people have friendships at work, I mean really close friendships, people who they socialize with outside of work, people who they enjoy being around, when they have that type of a connection, they stay longer, they work harder, and they're more satisfied in their jobs. Isn't that what you want? Don't you want your people to stay longer, be more satisfied, and work harder? So let's have a conversation about this. I can do this as a keynote speech at an industry conference. Or I can do a three-hour workshop where we come in and we start talking about trust and accountability and how that is the foundation for better relationships in the workplace. My name is Tom Singer, and I have been speaking to organizations for over 15 years. And now, in 2023, it's time to reinvent how we look at business relationships. I don't think people should feel disconnected. I think people don't want to feel disconnected. People want to feel that they're part of a community. They want to feel that their input matters, that they're asked to collaborate, and that their input is making a difference for the company. And they want to believe that their conversations matter and that they are being heard when they're talking. So I would love to have a conversation with you. You can reach me at tom at tomsinger.com, and we can find out if this program is the right thing for your company or your association to get people excited about the human side of business. Let's face it, a like, a link, a share and a follow is awesome. But if you're not famous, if you're not a Kardashian, the number of followers you have on social media really doesn't impact your life all that much. But when you have uncommon connections with people who really understand who you are, who you feel that they're there to help you and, and, and you want to see them succeed as well, that's when business becomes fun again. And that's when your team gets more engaged. I look forward to hearing from you.